With that in mind, mm-hmm. I would give Attack on Titan and no points allowed. No eight point. No, yeah. just straight yeah. whole numbers. I would give Attack on Titan. Ah. <laughs> Again, you said a great quote that I've, I've, I've heard as well. People are people. You said humans are going to do human. People are people. And I, was, I remember telling that to a colleague and said, what does that mean? So when you say people are people, when you meet another person, right, you're meeting another person who has been framed, shaped yep. and formed based on a number of different things, right? Mm-hmm. Now, if, they're, if their frame or if their formation has not been in parallel to you, you're going to be already in complete opposition. Yeah, you're going right? to be different. You're, you're going, going to be, be in complete yeah. opposition. Yeah. Now, yeah. it's up to you to have the mentality and the, I guess the intell- intellect and the patience to understand where they're coming from mm-hmm. or think, you know what, that person's an idiot. How can how dare you not like guns? How dare you be a vegan? Or how, how dare you like meat? All these different things, right? Instead of understanding each other, no, no, no. We just like... This person's dumb. They, this, this person's stupid. I don't know how. How did they grow up? How do, how were they brought up? People are people, and it's crazy. It's it's the stupidest it's thing. Crazy. It's the stupidest thing. It's like, like take take um and again I'm not gonna go deep into it because it's a whole can of worms. But just take how mm-hmm. certain people viewed um the COVID COVID situation about. Mm-hmm vaccine or no vaccine and what that was then turned into mm-hmm. um you take it when when it, wherever there's like a major um voting um or in, in parliament or in the u.s blue, red or blue you know democrat republican labor or conservative or brexit whenever yeah. what people fail to do and where we've all been guilty of this is that if you now do not believe what i do I am now going to associate you to also believing in this and other attributes that may or may not actually be true about you. So you, Mm -hmm. you, instead of me thinking, okay, so for example, let's make it a little less, less politically, (laughs) less politically uh, volatile. You say, for example, Ed, you're a vegan. I'm, and I, and I don't, I'm, I'm a carnivore. If I find out you're vegan, I am now then going to start associating you with, oh, and uh, and maybe this, due to my own incorrect knowledge, I'm going to say to mm-hmm. myself, oh, Ed's a vegan. He probably cares about non-traditional healing methods. He probably believes way more in Dr. Sebi. He, I bet he believes in astrology. He's a Gemini, isn't he? Mm. Oh, yeah, that's why. <laughs> you start to add all these things that actually, yep. when, uh, instead of yep. saying, oh, you're a vegan, what's that due to? Oh, um, actually, it's because mm-hmm. I actually um, I, I have like a severe allergy to one particular type of chemical, which is used in mm-hmm. in, in meat products. So, so it's easier for me to be a, a vegan. That then changes my whole viewpoint that I previously had of you. It's not because you believe in Doctor Sebi, and you know, it's actually because <laughs> oh, it's an allergy. Okay, fine, maybe I should just mm-hmm. be a little bit more respectful. But we don't do that. We go, we jump yeah. for the uh, immediate assumptions first, rather than yeah. saying okay to your point let's have a conversation about it um and actually to be fair i remember th- that's why i that's why i loved gabby's arc in attack on titan mm. because she went through that she was she was she got given information at a young age believed it met somebody that she was then called an island devil and then had to go mm-hmm. through that transformation and realizing that actually this is not the case mm-hmm. this is mm-hmm. this is not mm-hmm. what i'm told i don't know what who who am i what do i believe in what am i everything is like shattered and she has to kind of rebuild her own self afterwards I, that's why i really like it and guess what wasn't i one of the people saying yeah oh after the that gabby episode said yeah i'll stomp her out too i'll stomp her out how dare you take so- <laughs> I, I was doing the same thing so i'm not here like doing high and mighty i did the same thing i did the same thing when actually it's like well like wh- why did what do you know why have what what life has what what experiences have you gone through in your life which has led you to believe the things that you do um so yeah that's why i mean that's why i think gabby's gabby's um arc to me is one of, I, one of my favorite in the show one of my favorite in the show 
Mm. No, you're absolutely right. I think, um, what was I going to say? I think when it comes to, and by the way, we say we because me and Solo are not like immune to this. Uh, we've, I'm sure, have done this, the same kind of generalization or thinking, of course, oh, you're of course. this and therefore you must yeah, yeah, like yeah. this, you must like that. I think it's more so now as you get older, as you get more cognizant of it, you try to you try, come yeah, from a place agreed. of understanding as opposed to a, a place of assumption. Yes. So, but we're not yes. trying to say sit here on our pedestals and say, you know, no, no, <laughs> everyone but us is like this. Definitely no, not no, us. No. We're just uh, I've been guilty. guilty of it so many a times. <laughs> I'm still <laughs> guilty of it. Uh, but yeah, there's I can't remember the film, but there's a great film and it had um, Omar Epps in it. It was about mm-hmm. racism. And at the end of it, it says unlearn. And I think this is what we need to do as a society in terms of yeah, We need to unlearn, unlearn a hell of a lot. You're right. We need to unlearn what we've already been taught about another species, another gen- another people, um, another culture, whatever it may be. Because yeah. if you don't unlearn and you're going in there, well, all vegans are like this, all carnivals are like this, all black people, all, all white people, all this, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. You're never going to make room in your cup to grow. Or to True. like get True. filled because you're True. just completely True. blocked, mm-hmm. and I think this is what we need to do as a society to unlearn. Jeez, it was right that we said Doctor Solo was in the building. You know, you know, we have to call me Doctor Ed. Nah, there we go, there we go. Right, <laughs> like that was nice. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's nah, good. it's good. That's good. But it's true. It's absolutely true. Yeah, All right, cool. Yeah, We're coming yeah. to the end of it. So Solo, what do you um? We need to give a super anime rating, which we will. Ooh, but what do you yes. think the legacy of uh, AOT will be remembered? Uh, we're getting the anime, the anime manga community. Um, I mean, manga is a completely different thing, but um, mm. separate entity. But the anime community, as it were, what do you think the legacy of Attack on Titan will be? How has it contributed to the anime world as a whole? Do you know what? I was thinking about this, you know. I think its contribution is not speaking down to the younger generation. Mm, interesting expand like you've said you would have not expected a show like this to be a shonen you would have expected mm-hmm. the show mm-hmm. like this to be a seinen and if this was a seinen it unfortunately it also goes to show that it might not have reached the it might not have been as um it might not have had the re- uh, the relevant amount of backing behind it, a marketing push behind it, because it's the same thing. They typically they may, they may not always get the same because it's targeted to a different different demographic, right? Um, mm-hmm. So I think now I think its legacy is that it, it almost proves that the younger generation can and will enjoy slightly darker content. Yes. Yes, that's the, I think and its I'm, legacy. Uh, that's that's very his legacy. True. Yeah, that's his legacy. I mean, in terms of uh, age range, Attack of Time for me is a fifteen. But you know, oh, minimum, remember, minimum, <laughs> minimum. <laughs> but minimum. we see little kids <laughs> in doing uh, this, doing this, doing the salute, <laughs> doing the salute, <laughs> doing the scout salute. I'm like, man, little man. There's no way I'm letting you go outside little them walls. Little soldiers, boy. Oh, oh my goodness. No way goodness. I'm letting you go outside those walls. There, no way. Because it's quite graphic. Um, in terms, and you know what? I don't know if. You're right in that sense, Solo, that you know it doesn't look down. Basically, the author said, "This is what I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna create. I'm gonna write this. Gonna manga. I'm gonna make it as you know, real, um, sophisticated, uh, mentally um, complex. Mm-hmm. Obviously, you're gonna have your 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 death and so on and so forth, or not death, but your violence and so on and so forth. But mm-hmm. the violence in that is completely to a different to a JJK violence." Or a Naruto violence. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, it's, it's visceral. Not a case it's a where... visceral violence. It's, yeah, it's, it's, it's not hand to hand. It's not like it's not hand to hand. It's yeah. The stabbed in it's, the shoulder. It's... No, it's like yeah, yeah, yeah. Like this, this, this. I don't know. This violence. It kind of, it kind of cuts even me more deep. In regards to, there are like. There are consequences. These aren't people who get hit by and then hit, get, bounce off a building and get up and go. Ah, oh, you got me. <laughs> nah, this is a gunshot and you're dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This yeah, is, yeah. look at, um, what's her name? Sasha. What? Yeah. You're dead. Yeah, it's not this, like, oh, uh, we'll is, come this, back and you're, yeah. in hos- you're in hospital. Nah. Will she make it? And you hear the, Doot. Yeah. Doot. She, you're she not will. bouncing off yeah, buildings. Yeah, yeah, you're yeah, not yeah. like, nah, this is real. Yeah, And yeah. It, it hit deep. It hit, 
I think the Titans, as it were, um, potentially made it more kind of a fantastical element of it. Yeah, that's true, why true, potentially, true, true. But yeah. still, it was really graphic. Mm. Really graphic. I, I mean, I, okay, I guess in context... In, uh, there are going to be there are more graphic anime out there but I think if you like oh yeah JJK you, is more graphic for sure yeah I guess what you're saying in context to other your traditional battle shonen in context to your mm-hmm. traditional battle shonen this is it is more it is more uh, which I which I'm which I, I can agree with I can agree with um yeah. but no it's it's I think that's his legacy I think his legacy is just like look the young younger generations can and will enjoy serious sh- seri- more serious content and also more, se- I, I, not to say that. No, in fact, no. I'll, no, that's 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 a lie because anime has been covering ser- serious content for yes, decades. Yes, it so it's not that. It but been. I think I think it's yeah, like I said. I think I generally think this, that maybe okay, maybe mainstream shonen audience can and can and will enjoy slightly darker content if it's packaged in the right way i think that's it's that's it's um it's legacy um mm. n- uh, yeah that's I what i know. think it i is. think i, I mean uh, yeah, fair enough but i think for me the author and that's probably why he said watch the end i think yes it's an anime but you know stories are created to have True. an underlying yeah. lesson mm-hmm. and i think the animator wanted us all to learn a lesson regarding war mm-hmm. you know revenge is not always the answer you know um war begets war uh you know hurt people hurt people you know there's the 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 only victims and uh or the only i guess heroes in war not heroes but the only i can't remember specific quotes but there are only losers in war never winners as it were you saw the lives and i think that's what mm-hmm. the, um, the creator did very well you saw the lives of innocent people who had no yep. um yep. no involvement in the war being trampled being destroyed mm-hmm. just because of one man's insanity you know and i think what he wants us to learn is like look we all are different we all have different um different ideas different ideologies different mm-hmm. cultures but we there is there is a way to you know resolve conflict as opposed to just killing each other um and maybe that wasn't spoken about more but it was a case where he showed the consequences of what war has on people and it was dire 80 percent of the people um 80 percent of the population sorry died mm-hmm. you know it was great you know as humans we bounce back we move on but if we don't learn the, 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 the our lessons from the past We're then bound what, to what, what are we you know yeah. exactly what's the definition of insanity doing the same, same thing and thing. expecting Expect the, different the results yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what if we're doing the same thing again and again and again okay would you know it's crazy absolutely crazy um but yeah what an anime what what's your super what is what's what um what's your super anime what, what did we call our review system again i can't remember um <gasps> I don't think we named it, it but anyway, this is our rating, the yeah. super rating. What, super what's rating. your super rating? Yeah, my yeah, super yeah. rating, and again, reminder, mm. reminder, because it's been a while. But don't worry, we'll do more. We're going to do some more reviews coming up, so stay tuned for that. Um, zero is could not be worse. Ten is could not be better. Five is average. So none of this. Mm. Oh, what do you think of that film? Oh, about seven out of ten. Nah, seven out of ten is very good. Yeah. Five is average. With that in mind, mm-hmm. I would give Attack on Titan and no points allowed. No eight point. No, yeah. this is straight yeah. whole numbers. I would give Attack on Titan. Ah. <laughs> if I was allowed points after just saying that I'm not allowed, no. I would. Gi- I know exactly what I'd give it. You know what? I'm going to go with what I'll give it today and then I'll and explain afterwards. Nine out of ten. Yeah, I'm the same. I mean, nine to be honest, 10. if I could give points, I'll give it nine. I'm, I'm the same. If nine I could give 10. points, I would have said 9.5. Okay. Um, but yeah, nine out of ten for me. Nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. Um, I, think it's, I think it's quite easy. I think the the one big reason, rewatchability with something so serious. I can watch this whole thing from the beginning from tomorrow. 
and be completely happy. Mm. There are you're gonna pick things up I think again I and again and then, yeah yeah you're gonna pick things up mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. more on the on the second time around or on the third time around if people do want to watch it a third time. But I think yeah, Attack on Titan is one of those shows where I would gladly go back to the beginning and watch it again. I think it's yeah, but nine out of ten is 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 a solid score that I'd give Attack on Titan. Like I said, it's in the it's my top ten of all top ten all time easily. Not even. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't. I don't know where it is because I haven't thought about it. Thought about where it sits specifically, but it's hundred percent ten out of ten. Even with this ending, if people don't like it, and yeah, I'm not saying it's not without its flaws, but what it does do, it does well, and I like it. So mm. yeah, nine nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. Nah, couldn't have said it better, man. Couldn't have said it better. I think, uh, like I said, I would have given it a nine point five, but otherwise, a great story. Well mm. done to the author. You've really great. You've really created a story that has resonated with a lot of us and uh, touched a lot of people. And hopefully, we can learn lessons that you know through anime. You know, the the, the newer generation can mm-hmm. learn lessons about war.